Hey guys, welcome to today's very special video. There are many reasons why it is so special. First off, it is, you know, best under five. We love that. Who does not love a great deal? You guys, I started my channel wandering the aisles of the drugstore, getting you guys like the best tips and tricks on how to coupon shop, how to get makeup for free, how to do the buy one, get one 50% off, how to look for sales. And I never ever fell out of love with the idea of finding great makeup that would cost not too many dollars. So we are gonna be talking about really great products that are under five bucks. Many of them are brand spanking new. I was totally inspired to do this because I had picked up a bunch of stuff and I had been testing it out. And um, that's, you know, that's fun, right? And you're like, oh, great. We knew that it's best under five, Tati. We clicked on the video because of that. So that's today's video, but I also wanted to share with you guys. It's my birthday tomorrow and I feel really grateful. You know, I just wanna quickly say that 2019 taught me some really big lessons. It was a tumultuous year. It was a painful year. It was a beautiful year too though because so many wonderful things happened. And I have to say the biggest highlight for me was actually getting my palette to launch. I wanna really quickly give a little love to the Tati Beauty Textured Neutrals Volume One. The formula in here is just absolutely, hands down, just, it's so easy to work with. It's heavily pigmented, but it smooths out. And that's what I love about it. You know, I love that you guys really enjoy the whole different texture, monochromatic theme where you have matte, sequin, metallic, and then these gorgeous pressed glitters that are just like the most reflective thing you've ever seen in your life. I'm gonna go ahead and put on why don't we do a little ritual actually while I'm chatting with you guys about the free shipping that I am doing for my birthday. So before we hop into the affordable makeup that is really good and I do have some eyeshadow like in front of me. So don't feel like, you know, oh my gosh, Tati, here she goes with her product again. Da, 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 da. Yes, I am very proud of my brand or brands, but that won't stop me from sharing, you know, all of the things that I still love and test and try. So I wanna share with you guys. I have some international shipping options for you guys right now through Monday, because Monday is a holiday. We are offering free shipping internationally when you buy more than one palette. That is the best I could do. I know you guys are always like, oh my gosh, international, like don't leave us out. And I want you to know, I will always pursue options that will be better than where we are at right now. It does take time when you're building and growing a brand. There are a lot of moving parts, you know, shipping internationally, it's a tough thing, it's expensive. But I want you guys to have something that you can get in on, that you can feel like, hey, like she sees us too. And it's my birthday celebration and I wanted to do this because I thought it would be really fun this is my first birthday where I have a cosmetic line. So that's pretty dang cool to me. And I wanted to do something, you know? Ooh la la. That just like did it. For everyone else that wants to get in on a little free shipping for Tati Beauty, you can purchase a palette and a blendiful as, you know, companion little duo set right there. And you're gonna get free shipping in the US and Canada. Random, random side note, I was watching last night Robert Welsh. You guys, I'm gonna link him below. Go follow him, subscribe to him. His Tati Beauty review was such a surprise. Like I was at mentioned a bunch of times. He's a pro makeup artist. I have watched him a bunch because he does like professional makeup artists, judges, YouTubers makeup. And like you go and watch it and you're like, oh dang, like that's what you think? Like, oh, okay. And like sometimes I'd be like, no, that's like, but that's what I like because like he doesn't like that I contour my nose, I think. Whatever, I like it. And like, I think that like sitting face to face, anyone would agree that like, hey, it's commentary and like you do you. I digress. He also says like a lot of legit, like great things too. Like he has a lot of awareness and sense in his artistry. And he's a working professional makeup artist who makes videos here on YouTube. And I love his channel. I love him. I love Wayne Goss. They kind of, to me, feel like they have that, like I'm out in the trenches. I'm doing makeup on all ages, all skin tones, all skin types, eye shapes. And like, those are the masters. Those are the artists 
that you should want to learn from, I am telling you. So thank you for the review. I really, really love that you did that and I love that it was such a great review. And it just made me feel so secure again that I am on the right path and that making the choices that I have made with my palette that they do make sense. And the same thing is kind of happening with the Blendiful. We all know we had some issues that, by the way, absolutely dropped off of planet Earth after my video. I'm gonna get crap for that. I don't mean to, I'm just like, I'm really proud of this product and it's so good. And you know, everyone that has tried this and uses it, experiments with it, loves it. The Blendiful is just, uh, it is the way to make your face look so smooth, poreless, beautiful, everything. I love it. So again, you guys can get the Tati Beauty Textured Neutrals Volume 1 Palette and a Blendiful in the US and Canada with free shipping through Monday in celebration of my birthday and Valentine's Day and love and yay and why not. Or you can get two or more internationally with free shipping. Let's talk a little halo. I won't stay here long, but you guys, beauty from the inside out, that's what we started with. I am so passionate about it. The people that understand this product, love this product, use this product, they I think are gonna be like lifelong fans because I know for me, if I take even like two weeks away from Halo, I see changes in my skin. I see breakouts, I see my eczema coming back. That happened when I discontinued use over the holidays, you know, and people will be like, great, so I have to order this forever? It's like drinking water. You know, you're gonna have to continue to hydrate yourself throughout your life, you don't just, drink it for a couple days and you're done. You know, it's much like food. This is a, a way to supplement your diet and boost regeneration and boost, you know, a reduction of inflammation. And it has so many beautifying and healthy properties within. We have the Halo Hair Skin Nails, which is the original formula. It's kind of like the Cadillac formula that does it all. We have Kiwi, which really just targets skin and beautifying you from the inside out, aiding in hydration, firmness, helping to produce more collagen. I mean, it's just like, it's so good. You guys, it's really, I am not holding back anymore. I'm loudly gonna be proud of this because it works and it is something that I am so passionate about. It means everything to be in charge of your health. I know that very well. Reducing inflammation is something that is extremely important in my life, in my diet, in my overall well being, beyond just how my skin looks. So, you know, this, this product matters to me a great deal. Let's talk about the free shipping, shall we? <laughs> Any order you place tomorrow, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, you're gonna get free shipping here in the US on anything. Just like go to town, free shipping. Internationally, I am going to ask that you purchase three bottles or more. It is very expensive to ship. I really want to be able to do whatever I can for you guys in terms of, you know, celebrations. And you know, we're not a brand that has discount codes or sales. So this is not anything that we do often. Please keep that in mind. It was just like me being like, it's my birthday. And like, I wanna do something fun. I wanna celebrate the fact that I am still here on YouTube. I am 38. I'm in the beauty industry and I own two brands and I run them. I am not behind the scenes just being told what to do and putting on a pretty smile. I'm earning my seat at the table and I hope that that feels inspiring to you because I always dreamed that I could do something like this and to actually be living it. I want anyone else that looks at what I'm doing and goes, wow, that must be really, really great. I want you to know that you can put the work into whatever dream you are after, chase it, and you can catch it. You know, you can do it. I believe in you. I had to believe in myself when no one else did, and here we are. It's a big celebration for me. Free shipping US, three bottles or more, rest of the world. Let's get to some good under five products before I get weird and like cry. Okay, so here we go. I wanna share with you that I revisited this guy right here. They have a beautiful Joa display at my CVS. The, literally my CVS, the beauty section looks like freaking Sephora. It's wild. I'm like, when did this happen? They like remodeled it, it's a whole thing. Anyway, this right here is just so moisturizing. And the color is very almost sheer, but somehow it kind of like matches up with your natural lip color and is just opaque enough. 
It is a beautiful balm. I really, really love this. I like the packaging. Um, it's just cute, you know? Normally I don't like polka dots, but for some reason I just, this reminds me of like confetti on a cake. It's very birthday appropriate. So we have that guy right there. And then this is so random for me to love. It's like a green uh, reflect glitter. And oh my gosh. Can you see that? It's like green but Hollywood glam, how is that, right? Like how, how is that flattering? It's the weirdest thing to me. It looks very like a little, I don't know, like you have an attitude problem, but like in a cute way. It's really pretty on bare lips as well. It's just extremely high shine. And because of all of that itty bitty, you know, reflect glitter in there, that sparkle in there, it just makes the lips look giant. And it also just amps up that shine. So if you want something that's like a very glass-like shine with like these teeny tiny pinpoint, you know, pearl sparkle, ja ja, what, what, wow, wow in it, then I think that you would like love this. Also, Essence, they really did it with these. This is the Melted Chrome Eyeshadow. They are insanely good. This is beautiful. If you want a metallic, shadow that is literal, intense metallic. You will lose your mind for this. I've had one of these explode in my bag, be warned, because they are very fragile. It is just like a pressed pigment, I believe. Look at that. Dang, right? Oh my gosh, like they really did that. I'm wearing this on my eyes right now. I do have, of course, the glitter that you saw me put on top but it's really nice. I have not been this impressed with a drugstore shadow in a very, 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 very long time. It is high voltage, high shine. Okay, now if you are needing something petite, tiny, throw it in the purse, and you only have $3, you can totally get it done because this is three bucks. It is from e.l.f. These are so cute. This is the Bite Size Eyeshadow, and this one is in Cream and Sugar. And I think that the metallics are really nice. They're not as high shine as what I just showed you. It's a little more dulled down. You do have to be aware of not stacking or putting too much on at once. If you have a little bit of texture to your eyelids, you might run into a slight issue. The matte even is like surprisingly like not bad. It's three bucks. And I have just been like kind of like pleasantly surprised. I was gearing up to do like a full like new elf tested. I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna throw this in the under five. It's so good. It deserves a mention. So I wanna just, you know, give it a little moment and a shout out. They have a bunch of different colors. They wear very well. I don't really have any negatives to say. Let's talk about brows. So this right here is from Wet n Wild. This is the ultimate brow kit. And what I love is it has this right here that is not overly waxy and you can actually put a spoolie in it, brush your brows up and it will do kind of that like soap brow technique kind of a thing for you where it really will give you that like feathery look to your brow. Normally the itty bitty brushes that come with like something like this, especially for it being under $5, you look at it and you're like, yeah, forget you, whatever. This one, hold on to. It is so razor thin that you can actually get into this powder and you can really just get in there and do those lifelike, realistic looking strokes that look like your actual brow hairs. I really like this. It comes with like a cute little set of tweezers. I can't believe the price on this. This is so nice. It's really, really good. Random shout out, um, this brush from Essence, they actually came out with like a full collection of brushes and I was shocked. This is another one. I, this is a duplicate. I actually have one that's dirty right now. Um, I bought a couple of backups. I really like these. They're cute to look at. They have the rose gold, uh, feral, they, I don't know. I just was like, man, for $2.99, like this is pretty nice, you know? And I have been enjoying using them, like incorporating them in, you know, doing my makeup with only drugstore products and just kind of experimenting as I always do, trying to find new, fun, cool things that don't cost like a bajillion dollars. So uh, this definitely caught my eye. I really like just the quality. It does not feel like scratchy brushes and most of them are under $5, so that's really great. Another one from Joa, surprise, surprise, is a lip pencil. They have beautiful retractable lip pencils that are so creamy 
And why do I always wanna say so creamy, so dreamy? These are stunning. This is the color Nude. Don't like wind it up too high or you will snap it off, but like look at that, right? Gorgeous, it's so nice. All right, we also have the Wet n Wild, this is new from them, the Wet n Wild Breakup Proof. Kinda reminds me of Emotion Proof from Tom Ford, right? Like same vein. This is the Breakup Proof Waterproof Retractable Eyeliner. I hate this one and I love this one. So like, hear me out. This is newer, I had to mention it. It feels very similar to some of their old retractable pencils, but this is a color that I really have been enjoying. I really like an espresso brown, like super rich liner. It looks still intense and shapes the eye and frames the eye, but it's just dialed back enough that it lets you shine a little bit more and feels just a little bit more natural and can kind of set off your eye color a little bit better than black can sometimes. So I really love this. It is creamy. Once it sets into place, you're locked in tight. I'm wearing it today as my wing. So what I do is I actually take an angled brush and I like clean up the edge and I pack on some shadow on top of it. I like to take Ritual as a powder topper to any brown liner from the Tati Beauty palette. Pack that on and then you are just like locked in till you take it off. It's really great. The one thing that I will say with this, don't wind it up. You will break it. It's very soft. It's surprisingly soft. So just keep that in mind. And if you do and you can handle that, then this is a phenomenal, phenomenal liner. I also want to give a little love to this Joa brow pencil. This is in, I was just going to say the shade's wooden. You idiot. This is a wooden brow pencil. What is the shade? Brown. Um, so sophisticated. Okay, so this right here, I wanna show you because it's a very interesting formula. It's very almost powder-like. So what I like to do with something like this is I actually do like to kind of go in a little bit harder, a little more liberally, and almost get that like base of the brow completely filled in. And then I take a darker and I kind of feather through. I have been enjoying my Hollywood glam I've been enjoying a darker lip, a bolder brow, juicier skin. Like I'm into that right now. You guys, I got to go to Elton John's Oscar party. He has the Elton John AIDS Foundation and they always do an Oscar party after the Oscars. I was invited. I got to walk the, I was gonna say red carpet, but it was a white carpet. And it was just like a very magical, surreal moment. So I got to do that and I just, I felt like it was the right thing to do to have a red lip and I wore a dress that a few of you guys commented on this and I'm like, oh my gosh, I love my audience. Like they know how cheesy I am and they like, they get me. I wore a dress because it reminded me <laughs> of the glitter shade ritual from my palette. So I was like walking around like, all night, like I am my glitter pan of shadow right here. So it was so fun and um, hello, I somehow was standing like right at the exact spot where Elton John came and performed. Like he literally was like this, like he was like right here. Like I made eye contact a couple times and it was almost, it was almost like too much. Like I was like, oh my God, I should like look away. Um, it was so good, it was so, so good. Best night, so much fun, met a lot of cool people and it just, it felt right. And so did my big brows and my red lip. So moving forward, I feel like I'm trying to master even more so just kind of going with more of like a Hollywood glam aesthetic. Like I really like that look and something that is powdery and soft like this will help you get there pretty quickly. I wanna give a like itty bitty shout out to this, the blush from Essence. This is a very soft blush. This does not have a lot of pigment. It is very matte. But the thing that I love about this is it is extremely blurring. So it's like you don't need to put a ton of powder on the face. You could actually go in with the blush in this area here and it will help to just set the foundation, make your pores look less visible. It's a really cool formula, so I wanted to give it a mention. This is the Muse and this is a Kiss Lash. It's what I'm wearing right now. It has been my favorite recently. It is literally like I don't have to you know, trim it, I don't have to do anything. The band itself has a nice bend, so you literally just go dink, dink, and you're like, I'm done, um, and it's so good. Very glamorous lash, but if you're like me and you like the shadow to kind of peek through, it is like 
fluttery enough that it will do that. So it's so nice. I have talked your ear off. Thank you so much for hanging out with me, talking a little, you know, budget friendly whatnot from the drugstore and then birthday and future things for Tati Beauty. There's future things for Halo Beauty. We're all just gonna be, you know, in the makeup and taking care of our health as well. That's so important. So I will put all the information as far as free shipping and all of the deals that will be good through Monday in the description box below. Please go visit tatibeauty.com to learn more and also halobeauty.com to learn more. There's a lot of information on each site. I will also be linking their IGs as well. And you can see before and afters on Halo. They are very, very impressive. And then, you can see magnificent makeup over on the Tati Beauty IG. I really, moving forward, want to showcase smaller influencers. I don't like calling people a micro, and there's gotta be a better word, right? I just wanna help elevate talent. Let me just say that. And I would love to do like the thing where there's like a story takeover, or something like that. I'm, I'm thinking about it. Let me know if you guys would be into that. But in the meantime, there already is a lot of gorgeous, gorgeous content over there. So go check it out. And I love you guys so much. Happy Valentine's Day, whether you're single, whether you're hooked up with someone else, married, whatever, just enjoy a day of love. Love yourself, love others, and I'm just really grateful that we are starting the year off now that we're like done with January because I think everyone hated January. I hated January, you hated January, it was weird. Um, but February is gonna be much better and positive thoughts. All right, I love you all. I will see you in my next video. Mwah.